folks, this is Mike from Ham Radio Science. Today we're going to take a look at a new piece of software for Android called SDR Touch that allows you to use your Android tablet or possibly an Android phone as a decoding and receiving device for a RTL 2832U stick. So let's take a little closer look at SDR Touch. Okay, here's what you're going to need. You're going to need, of course, an Android device. Today we're using the Nexus 7. Also, you'll need a RTL 2832U stick. And more importantly, you're going to need a OTG adapter cable. Now, the OTG cable is very important because that you just can't use any old adapter cable. It has to be an OTG type cable. So we're going to connect this all up and come, come back. Okay, you can see that we've connected our OTG tech cable and our RTL 2832U stick and of course we have a little antenna over here that comes with the RTL 2832U and we're currently looking at a wide FM signal from our local FM broadcast stations. Now you can see, let's take a little closer look here. Let's zoom in some. Okay. Here's a little closer look at SDR Touch. And we're here again currently receiving a FM broadcast, wide FM. You can see in the spectrum display we have two signals that are showing up here. And we can tune the um, SDR Touch software by simply moving the slider down. Now we're not quite right on the signal, so we can adjust the bar up here to get us a little closer. We also have the ability to set a frequency directly simply by typing it in. Okay. Um, outside of that, that's really about all we can turn the spectrum display off and on. The author intends to add some more features to the software as we kind of go along. Let me get that back over there. There we go. And uh, here's where you can change your modes. He has several different ones here that we can use. Okay. So we're back to wide FM. Uh, we're going to hook this up to our Ham It Up converter and see what kind of. Um, so let's just see if it works. Okay, we have it connected to the Hammond Up converter and you can see that it works somewhat uh, with the CW. Uh, we did try to tune around a few upper sideband uh, transmissions and um, they seem to be a little bit weak or low. So I believe the author is still working on the um, other modes that's probably why we have a little exclamation point by the by the mode. So all in all, this software, SDR Touch, has some really uh, nice potential. And we hope to be seeing a little more uh, from it in the future. Okay folks, that's pretty much SDR Touch. It's a cool piece of software. If you want to know a little bit more about it, check out our little article on uh, www.hamradioscience.com. Again, thanks for watching.